Johnny Seiden here for Irishboxing.com with Steve Ward. Did you look good to be back. Johnny Good man. Yeah. Good night to be talking to you again. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's a long time. It feels it like... It must be moisturising. You're getting younger again. <laughs> <laughs> Say that again. Uh, but, like, it feels like so long, doesn't it? Like, it, it is. Yeah. Uh, like, 20, 26 months since the Kunkabaya fetch. Ooh. December 2021. Um, just had a nightmare. Had a nightmare. Um, and they were just in activity. Yeah. Couldn't get fights. Fights were falling through. Um, just everything went so quiet after the Kunkabaya fight. You know, it was December 2021. Yeah. Everything just went so quiet. I've been working as a youth worker. I'm training. I'm doing everything. I, but I know stage where you retired there, were you? No, I never planned to retire. I was yeah. always... I was, you know yourself, I mean, you get pissed off. I was blowing hot and cold in the gym. I was coming in dead motivated. And yeah, training, yeah, yeah. And then weeks were passing. Nothing was happening. And I was coming off. No, I wasn't on like going off in the drink, I was just coming off and living on bog standard life and then back in the gym and then but I'm with Lee Eaton now. Um, yeah. he's a great manager. Um and he's gonna get me out on Saturday here and then um, we, we wanna move fast, you know. I don't wanna be in and just having a fight here and there, I wanna be in the deep end now. And you couldn't probably take another layoff, could you? Like just mentally no, I can't. Like... I can't from my head, I yeah. love the sport. I love the sport, keeps me sane. Um I've done it for 22 years now. Mm. I know I know of a couple of years left of me, 100%, but it's just about coming and making an impactful. And that's what people were, were, were asking beforehand. They want to know what the kind of aspirations are. Like, it's not, this isn't any sort of farewell or just fainting nah, or... No, nah, it's not. It's not. I can guarantee you I'll be in good fights this year. I can guarantee you if Lee be even behind me, yeah. I'll get this one. I'm not expecting a massive fight this weekend, but I want to go in and get the rust off, see how the body feels. Um, I feel a better cruiser weight now, I feel more developed. Um, so I'm looking forward to getting in, performing and getting and, and get moving, mate. I, I, honestly, I'm feeling I'm so excited about it now. And that's good to have that back, isn't it? Like yeah. that sort of buzz. And like what are you expecting kind of ring rust wise? Like are you will you are you expecting to be a bit below par or are you thinking you're I don't know. I've never been in a, I've ha, it's never been this long since I started boxing. Yeah. I started eleven. <coughs> never went this long. So it's a bit of a on unknown territory yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really know but I'm professional enough to know what I've been doing outside the gym I don't think it'll affect me that much I think if anything it'll make me a wee bit more gun ho maybe a bit more bloodthirsty and I'm hoping yeah, yeah, yeah so are we and how are you enjoying cruiserweight like is it love it. Yeah. love it you know it's it's just so much better it's so much better for me how I was making 12 7 <laughs> I don't know and Frampton always sends me cars always send me like like Instagram gifts of like people shrivel up yeah. and on like you make a one seven five. So it's good. It's good and now this weight's in two oh seven, so it's seven pounds over. I feel really good. Um Is there a difference in how you punch or anything or I you, think so. Yeah. I think so. I think before I was massive volume puncher, I was mm. I, you know, I was a big man with the volume output was always big. Probably not as big now. Um I can feel the difference. I can feel the weight on me, but I don't bother away. Quality more than quantity now. Jobs just as busy, but just uh, just just thinking about shots more. And when you look at the cruiserweight division, like British boys, it is, isn't it? And is there like is there a pathway there or is there particular oh, names you see? Yeah? yeah, there's definitely a pathway there. We're 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 talking to a few people that are interested in fighting already, you know, we'll get this one over me. Wanna tell us any names? No, because <laughs> I'm a big bore. Yeah. Um, no, but listen, there's, there's, there's people out there that it's, it's such a hot division. It's trying to get them now because they're all so far up the ladder and yeah, they're yeah, yeah. the ladder. You know, there's there's, there's, there's a couple in my head and I'm thinking of that I'd love to have. I'd, I'd fight him. Mm. I'm Smith, I'd fight. I'd love him. Obviously, they're... But I feel brass next to Anna because they're yeah, up yeah. the ladder than me. But I would jump at them fights. But I'm Smith, you know, with Coley, you've got Reactor, you've got even Elisoro. Uh, I would love that one, the Saudi bill. That was and they're all possible, are they? I think so. Yeah. I think so. I think... Now, they're not going to take me right away, but I think I'll get a win at the weekend and, and we'll definitely create a pathway. Do you know what? I don't have to worry about it, mate. They just... Let lead and do the same, yeah. and I just perform in the gym. Um, I'm very, very lucky where until that we quiet bit, I've had good people around me in boxing, yeah. good boxing people, and I, I'm, st- I'm still in that circle, you know, good people behind me, and I'm, I'm grateful for it. Lovely, I appreciate it. Thank you, man. Good to have you back. Thanks, man.